Welcome, welcome, welcome to the Mastermind Show. This is Mastermind speaking, a.k.a. Elijah the Great. And yeah, folks, what I mean by that, uh, you know, okay, back to the show, folks. Uh, I was in the world that was basically falling apart, you know, with the meteors and stuff. And, the well, you know, the world that I was just helping the, the people, uh, let's see, Azteca. Uh, I was helping them, a bunch of wizards trying to go through there. And uh, you'll see that in... Either Saturday or, or Sunday, or maybe Saturday and Sunday's videos. Um, you know, you're going to be back to one video a day, so that might be Saturday and Sunday right there. Uh, I'm not sure yet. I mean, you know, I film these videos, and uh, sometimes it might be months later before I even post them. Uh, there's nothing wrong with that, you know. Uh, whatever the particular mood goes and how it, how it swings or how, however you go. Uh, what happened, folks? I, I come through the commons, and there was some wizards in here, and they were using some foul language or, or so, and uh, we don't want that for the show. So I just went ahead and uh, instead of cutting it out of the film, I just went ahead and done a new video and told them all to have a blessed day. <laughs> and here we are, folks. Uh, we're going over here to the dye shop. We've got some new subscribers that we're going to be going to tell you about we're just gonna go in the die shop for now you gotta watch where you hang out at here on wizard 101 just like anywhere in, in, in the real world you know you got people that can be mean and things like that we ain't got time for that folks I tell you what let's go right on ahead and dye our suit here let's see I tell you what, folks. Today, today we're gonna we're gonna dye the suit real weird looking. So we're gonna have a have a green suit, green with green with uh, let's see, green with gold, and our boots. Let's have our boots. They're already purple. Let's put some uh, put some orange in the boots and the hat. The hat will be... Oh, wait. Forgot to die. <laughs> uh, let's see. Green. Uh, what was it? Was it green and gold? I forgot what I put the boots as. Alright, let's have green and blue. Green and blue, purple, purple gold, and our hat will be red. Well, red, red and red and silver. Yeah, red and silver. All right, folks. Let's let's, uh, let's go ahead and get on in the fishing, and we're gonna bring Otis with us. All right, we're gonna go to Avalon as our first world. Let's go ahead and uh. Let's go ahead and port back to the house. And really, that was my fault, folks. Uh, because I usually change the realms. And then when you change the realms, you can prevent a lot of traffic and you might not run into a, a few wizards that are not being polite so if I got this right let's see we got 95 subscribers and it went down to 94 and now it's back up to 95 so what I did is I took some of those uh, Ricardo's because we had so many Ricardos. 
Hey, we appreciate you subscribing many times, you know. I tell you what. Oh, yeah, I, I, I mean, if that's legal, I mean. Well, you'll see what I'm talking about in just a few minutes, folks. Uh, let's go ahead and catch our first fish. Let's see. Let's go ahead and. Uh, oh, wait a minute. Is our basket. Is our basket full? Yeah, the basket's full. We're going to have to go back and. I tell you what, we're going to go to. Uh, Matter of fact, we'll let this be the second world. We're going to go in Grizzleheim. Because we got to go to the fish basket, man. So we're going to go to Grizzleheim. Which is a great place to fish. One of my great friends. Very special person to me. We used to fish here all the time. And I hope and pray we start to fish again. We might not put it on the camera, because, you know, she may be a little camera shy. There's nothing wrong with that. Alright, folks. Help me find the fish basket, man. Oh, there he is, right there. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Is that the fish? Oh, it's, uh, the, the fish guy's up here. What in the world was that? Little bitty miniature bear there. Might be a gummy bear. All right, folks. There's the fish master. We're gonna sell. Let's see. We'll sell about. Let's say about sell about five fish today. All right, there's one. Got a bunch of fire cooters. Yeah, let's go ahead. One, two, three, four. All right. I tell you what. Let's go ahead. And sell two more of those. We'll catch seven fish today. Hey, hey now. Hey, what kind of fish is that? Dragonfly fish. Alright. Alright, folks. Let's go ahead and fish right here in uh, Grizzleheim. We'll fish. We'll fish right here. Balance bait. See if we can catch this fish with one hand. Did we do it? No, we didn't do it. Come on, fish. I should do it. Maybe not. There we go. harder with one hand here.
like a small fry right there. Oh, okay. I can push that button there. I don't have to push the space bar. Okay. Well, good. Now I don't have to use my left hand at all. For now. Alright, folks. Let's see if I can catch me a fish here. These fish can be tricky. Very sneaky fish. There's a big fish right there coming. A little bit more difficult using one hand. We're gonna make it work though. I'll keep the clicker button right here. As soon as you hear that little beep, gotta pull it in. There it is! Well, let's try again. These might be higher level fish than what I'm usually used to fishing. We're gonna still try to. We're gonna wait just a little half a second this time after that little beat. Gotta time it just right. Might be it right there. There it is. All right, folks, we went, we went ahead and got ourselves a 24.2 fire cuda. That fish right there is a keeper, a fire fish, known for their hot tempers and attraction to bright, shiny things. Look for them in warm patches of water all over the spiral. All right, folks, uh, we're gonna go ahead and tell you who the 94th subscriber is uh, Digby Greenleaf. All right, 94. All right, folks, let's go ahead. And get a little screenshot of the fish there. Let's go ahead and see if we can catch another fish. There's one right there looking at us. Have a storm. There we go. There's a nice waterfall here. That one got away.
see what we can get here. There we go. Got another fire cooter. Known for their hot tempers and attraction to bright shining things. Look for them in the warm patches of water all over the spiral. 18.8. That one's a keeper too. Fire fish. Alright. And yeah, folks, uh, speaking of catching two fire cooters, I, I think that this guy is, uh, this is either Johnny Arcade's brother or, or it, 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 I think, I think this is his brother. And the, the, the name is saying, uh, let's see, our 95th subscriber, the name is saying Arcade, uh, not Nadia. I think that's Johnny's brother. Or it might be uh, Johnny. I, 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 I know. I think we got Johnny Arcade already, and I think that's his brother. So yeah, there's our 95th subscriber. All right, all right. Let's go ahead and catch us five more fish. We'll catch one more here. Or we'll try to. Like there's a fish right there. There it is, another fire cooter, looks like. 16.6 fire cooter fire fish, known for their hot tempers and attraction to bright shiny things. Look for them in the warm patches of the water all over the spiral. All right, folks, and uh, as I was looking at the at the subscribers, uh, it, it went down to 94, and one guy tells me that he subscribed, uh, and that was Adam Frost. So you know, I, I had to look look there on the subscribers. Uh, you know, I had to look there on my on my on my uh, where I wrote all the. I had to look there in our subscribers, and see. You know which number is which, I guess, because now it's getting a little hard to keep up with. But yeah, that, you know that that's Adam Frost. Uh, I reckon if it goes, let's see, if it goes down to 94 and then back up, I reckon that's 95. But then I, I would just put him over there on number 60. We're going to take one of them Ricardos because I think Ricardo subscribed to us about five times, and then uh, we'll just put him there on number 60. And we got one more subscriber to. T uh, you know to tell you and like I say it goes down and goes up so we're gonna probably put him over there on uh, about 59 you know all these Ricardos and we'll tell you who he is in just a few in a few minutes we're gonna catch another fish first so let's uh let's go uh, let's see we caught three fish then we got four more in the to go yeah, so we're gonna go ahead and get back in the boat. We're going to Avalon. Well, we hit we hit the wood post there. I tell you what, them, them frost flowers are really special. I just passed one. We're gonna go on the rainbow road bridge. Matches our suits. And now we're gonna go to Avalon. catch I think we're gonna catch one fish here then we're gonna move on to the next world all right folks let's go ahead and see what we can catch in here let's use the life bait
Uh oh. Threw a little too far there. There we go. Our next subscriber like I like I was saying you know it went from 94 to 95 it kind of gets confusing to me so uh, I know we're we're right at 95 again so that's good so uh, we're gonna be telling you who our I guess you could say our new 95th subscriber is or no that's right we, we, we took one of the Ricardos and, and so this would be like uh, 59 yet we still got 95 subscribers if that makes sense so yeah folks we're gonna be telling you who that is in just a few and you're gonna see uh, as I help this wizard probably about tomorrow or Sunday when I when I uh, release that when I put that video out there when I, when I upload that video as soon as we catch a fish here See, folks, some of them come and some of them go. I tell you what, you know, it's just like subscribers and people, I reckon, you know. Some of them fall off, fall off of the boat, and we're trying to, you know, see if they can float and see if we can find them and, and, and bring them back in there, you know. I, I, I watched the number go down or go up, and, you know, I want the number to keep going up. We're trying to make it to 100, you know. All right, folks. Do we got them? Do we got them? We got them. All right. We got a 15-pound mainstream Delcoy, the most commonly seen and unintentionally caught of all the balance fish. That's right. It's a balance fish. Find them wherever more impressive fish are hiding throughout the spiral. All right. And yeah, uh, we got a Tyler Mythbreaker and. You know, that would normally probably be like the, that would be like the 96th subscriber, but something happened here and it went to 94, 95, so we're just going to put him over there on number uh, 59, over there where all them Ricardos were at. <laughs> Alright folks, so there we go, we got 95 subscribers, alright, alright, Tyler Mythbreaker, we appreciate you buddy. And yeah, speaking of Adam Frost, I think Adam Frost just signed on. Or signed off. All right, and hey, there's Tyler Mipbreaker right there, still online. We helped him, and we helped Tiffany Icebreaker uh, a few moments ago. We just helped uh, Wolf uh, Wolf Stormblood, and that that might be a future subscriber. And there's there's our great subscriber right there. That, there's our great friend Brandon Wildheart. He helped us uh, in a dungeon. Uh, with some wizards there uh, and I did a video not too long ago on that one alright folks uh, let's go ahead and uh, catch us three more fish might catch three more subscribers now let's go ahead and get right back on the boat this time oh there, there he is right there there's Adam Frost we're going to go ahead and uh Gonna go ahead and catch three fish in Dragon Spire. There's plenty of room for subscribers, folks. Uh, if the number goes up or goes down, you know, I'm gonna I'm tell you. <laughs> you know, I'm gonna like, hey man, you know, something, something's going on here. But we appreciate you folks. If you tune in, if you tune out, we still appreciate you. And if you do tune out and, you know, if you if you don't subscribe or unsubscribe, 
I hope and pray you come back one day, you know, because we're going to the top, folks, and I want to take everybody to the top with me. You know, uh, that's just how I am, folks. Let's go ahead and let's try to fish in here. Now we're going to be doing some lava fishing, folks. We done caught all them fire fish. Now we're going to go into lava. Tell you what, my finger over here is burning like lava. So I'm going to have to take me a break after this, folks. Now when I come back, I'll probably do your fishing planet video. Let's see here. Uh, there's some fish right there. Let's cool them fish down and put an ice bait in there. You gotta be careful not to catch a center tool. Cause they take your bait. You can catch them though if you're quick enough. Did we get them? No. Let's try it again, folks. There we go. That fish went right on through that one, didn't it? The ice might be too cold for him. Speaking of ice, I need to put some ice on my left hand, folks. I tell you what. You know, get the swelling down. And hopefully I can bend my fingers again. There we go. We got one. Looks like we got quite a few. Got life school of fish, 24.9. The healthiest of all schools of fish, these fish are rarely absent. However, they do have a surprisingly high rate of tardiness. And that's a life fish, folks. All right. We're gonna keep on fishing, uh, I think with some, uh, well, uh, ice bait, yeah, I reckon we do one more with ice bait. I don't think I think this fish do, doesn't know which which way it wants to go. Let's try right here. Uh, maybe not. That should do it. I think we missed it by a hair. It looked like, look like there's a little small fry in there. There might be a center tool over here.
There we go. That one got away. Let's see if we can catch this little small fry here. We need more line. <laughs> uh oh. We ran out of ran out of room there. We'll try it. I think we're gonna get this one. I think we're gonna get him. No. We gotta get two more fish, folks. There's one right there. Let's see if it's right on the edge. Let's see if we can, if we can get that one there. Did we get him? See if we can get this one. Oh, come on. Where'd that fish go? There he is. Wait a minute, it's like a little small fry right there. Let's see if we can get that small fry. Huh? Let's try under the bridge. Might catch a troll fish. gonna leave it right there I think this fish right here is gonna go for it yep I always have to have patience let's see there it is Got a keeper, a life fish, 20.2 pounds, life school of fish, the healthiest of all schools of fish. These fish are rarely absent, however, they do have an surprisingly high rate of tardiness. Alright, folks. And we're gonna try to catch one more. I tell you what, let's turn the heat up. It's already hot outside. Let's go ahead and put a fire. Fire bait. Let's see. Let's try to catch this big fish right here. Oh, big fish. Alright, we have to come up here, folks. If that fish turns, well, turned the wrong way. 
Alright, let's see here. We probably should have just kept the bait right there. We're gonna try for it! Let's see. Maybe if, uh, at that angle, well, it done turned again. Oh, there we go. They're coming back. It's a race to the bait. Or maybe not. <laughs> Let's just throw it right over here and see what happens. There we go. That one got away. There's one. When he turns, that should go right th there we go. There it is! We done caught, uh, I believe it's a balance fish. Yep, balance fish. Mainstream Delcoy, 18 pounds. The most commonly seen and unintentionally caught of all balance fish. Find them wherever more impressive fish are hiding throughout the spiral. Alright, folks. I think that's gonna do it. Let me look in here in my basket. Yep, we, we actually caught seven fish there. Alright, folks. We'll do a little dance. And that basically... Well, well hold on. <laughs> that basically concludes this uh, video here. Alright, folks. Go ahead and have yourself a very blessed day or a very blessed night. And I'll see you in the next video.